So, you decided to play on Wrath of the Lich King, but the choice of classes and specs is too overwhelming? You have come to the right place. Starting our list is a class for everyone. Whether you're a complete beginner, new to World of Warcraft in general, or just can't make up your mind and don't have a preference when it comes to the playstyle, Druid is always a good pick. Druids have everything. They can cover all three roles, tank, heal and DPS. And not only that, they actually have both a melee DPS spec and a ranged DPS spec as well. It is the only class in game that has all these options. So even if you end up not liking to tank or DPS, you can heal. If you don't like to heal and tank, you can DPS. And even if you don't like to be a melee DPS but prefer to be a ranged class, you can respec to Boomkin and you are ready to go, without having to level an entirely different class. The choice is yours. On top of that, since you are a hybrid class, you have incredible healing, defensives and DPS capabilities in every spec, so it's also a great class for beginners. Druid is also the most mobile class in the game thanks to the shape shifting, which will make it much faster while leveling, but also if you are into making gold with gathering professions such as mining and herbalism. Another similar choice of a class is Paladin. Also a hybrid, it doesn't have a ranged DPS spec to choose from unlike the Druid, and it also lacks the mobility, but it is fairly easy to learn how to play, and it has all the healing and defensive abilities you will need, even as a DPS spec, so it's pretty easy to level with. Prat Paladin is also the best tank in the game in many situations, as well as Holy Paladin being a top healer. If you want to level to max as soon as possible, choose Hunter. Hunter is the easiest class to level up with and is a very popular choice for people that just want to get to level 55 as soon as they can to create a death knight character. Hunter almost never dies. He can kill monsters from afar and the majority of work is done passively by his pet. Another popular choice when it comes to leveling is a mage. Especially a frost mage since it can freeze its enemies in place making it easier to kill them and less likely that they kill you. If you have already decided you are into playing a DPS spec only, but don't know which class in particular, your best choice will be a class that has multiple DPS specs to choose from, since chances are, at least one of the specs will be great in endgame PvE. The top performing PvE DPS classes overall in Wrath of the Lich King are Rogues, specifically Assassination and Combat, and Warlocks, especially Demonology and Affliction. Although there are many other choices, with both Rogues and Warlocks you have 3 DPS specs to choose from, and even though their PvE performance changes throughout the content patches and different rate tiers, due to tier set bonuses and so on, both classes have at least one spec that is performing exceptionally well in that specific rate tier. So, Rogue for PvE melee lovers, Warlock for PvE caster slash ranged enjoyers. If you are into tanking and want an easy way out, Paladin is probably the easiest tank to play for a beginner. It has a straightforward rotation and also two taunt abilities, one of which doesn't even require you to target that specific mob you want to taunt, which makes it super easy to use even for a beginner tank. If you're into healing, on the other hand, a Holy Paladin might be the easiest to play, especially on the Ice Crown Citadel season, you're a one button wonder. Probably 90% of the time, all you will be doing as a Holy Paladin in the endgame is spamming Holy Lights, so it can't get much easier than that. If you want to play a class that is needed in every raid group, a Shaman would probably be your best bet. Every raid group needs at least one Shaman for Heroism slash Bloodlust. If your raid group doesn't already have one, you will get a raid spot for sure, even if you are slightly undergeared compared to the rest. For PvP, there's a couple of choices. As a PvP healer, you will most likely want to play a Holy Paladin. It has a fairly simple playstyle and is super bulky. If you are more into offensive healing and dispelling your party and enemies alike, a Discipline Priest is the way to go. However, you will sacrifice a lot of that bulk and will be a frequent target of warriors and DKs who will try to kill you so your partners will need to help you and peel for you. For PvP DPS, if you want to play with a healer behind your back, roll either Warrior or DK. Both of these are made to tunnel your opponents to the ground. Playing with a Disc Priest, choices like Rogue, Feral or Frost Mage are also very good. If you like fast games as I do, and want to play a double DPS comp in 2v2, you can play a Rogue, Frost Mage, Retribution or Prag Paladin, Marksmanship Hunter, Shadow Priest or Enhancement Shaman. It depends a lot on your playstyle and arena comp you are playing. 
I will be making a separate video on the best arena comps in the future where I go more in depth. But if you have any questions or any ideas for other classes that could make the list, please let us know your tips.